What's going on guys? Savage Reptiles here. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, and share as it really helps the channel out. I got a message from a, a nice woman. Um, she reached out to me um, to show me some videos and pictures of her snake. I got permission from her to go ahead and make a video about this topic um, just because it does involve her business. But she reached out to me to showcase some photos and videos of her snake. Gorgeous snake, by the way. Um, but it was incorrectly sold to her for what she thought it was. And it turns out that's not what it is. So this term has been going on for a very long time. And to my knowledge, um, the community is trying to get rid of it, but there's just people that still labeling these snakes as something that they aren't. So she sent me the photos and um, her message said, look at the new snake I just got, um, gorgeous black blood python. Now for um, my viewers that do keep short tails, you guys know the difference between um, black bloods and what I'm about to go over. So I did not want to come off as rude or disrespectful to her, but I did go ahead and compl compliment her snake and I let her know that what she indeed had was not a black blood python. She had a Sumatran short tail. Um, and it was, it's, it's pure black, it's gorgeous, but it's just not a black blood python. Um, dude, he, he scares me sometimes. So like, he'll, he'll be moving and I won't feel it. And like my thumb just hit him and he jerked. So he made me jump a little bit. Um, but he, he always, he always gets me. Um, but yes, um, she had a Sumatra short tail, which is a close cousin to blood pythons. So it is, I believe it goes in order from Bloods, Borneos, and Sumatrans, and in that order from largest to smallest, and as some people would say, from most popular to least popular. Um, but um, she had a solid, solid black snake. It was a Sumatran. Um, blood pythons are Python Brangersmai. Um, the Borneos are Python Bright and Steamy and the Sumatran short tails are Python Curtis. So it is indeed um, three different species of snakes. Yes, they look similar, but they are three different species and um, they're a close cousin to each other. But it's just the fact that um, she was so excited about, you know, making a big purchase on what she thought was a solid black um, blood python and it just turned out not to be the case and um if i'm not mistaken she reached back out to the breeder to the breeder i'm sorry that um that sold her the snake as a black blood and um the breeder didn't reach back out to her um she said she couldn't even see if he read the message before apparently he had the receipts on to where she could see if he read it she said she believes he turned them off and she now can no longer see if he read the message or not. And he has not responded to her. Um, now it is, it's, I believe it's going on 72 hours since she's had the snake and no response. So more than likely this breeder knew that it was a Sumatran short tail, labeled it as a black blood. Um, just so someone that really didn't know what they were looking for, or what they really wanted, um, would know what he was selling. So it's just a very unfortunate situation. Um, again, this is a video to just put more awareness out there that if you are going for a short tail species and if you are going to be a keeper of short tails, I think it's very important that you know exactly what it is that you have. Um, there's Jasper again. You guys saw the video yesterday and he was just going crazy. I mean, he's, he's a very vocal cat, I love him. Um, <laughs> um, yes, but if you're going to keep short tails, it's definitely important that you know exactly what it is that you're keeping. Um, I haven't seen anybody get confused with, um, with Borneos, even though I'm pretty sure it's happened. I haven't seen anything about it. Um, just like I've mentioned before, there's a reptile shop, maybe 35 minutes away from me and, um, 
you guys have. He's he's going crazy. Um, there's a reptile shop called Tropical World Pets near me. Um, it's about 35 minutes away, and they have a Borneo short tail python, but it's labeled as a Borneo blood, and it's been there for months. I believe now it's going on maybe seven months since he's been there, um, and nobody has gotten him. And I'm not sure if it's because that people see him and know it's not a Borneo blood and skip out on him, or maybe he's just not as aesthetically pleasing as something that they're looking for. Um, but he's definitely been there for quite a while. I started to get him maybe four months ago, um, just to get him out of the shop's care because they don't care the best for him um, as they really don't for the majority of their reptiles. They have a really nice, fish selection that's what they specialize in they specialize in in fish i can't take that credit away from them if i was to go shopping anywhere in st louis for fish it would be that spot for sure for fresh and salt water can't deny it but their care for reptiles is is pretty poor um so i did start to to purchase him um but i got brock he was a rescue and then um, not long after him, I got Leviathan. And then not long after Leviathan, I got Hera. Then I'm already looking at more. I'm already looking at more bloods. So I can't I can't get them. As much as I want to help them out, I can't. At least not right now. Um, I can't really see them going anywhere. But, um, yeah. I think what I'll do on his end, just for assistance, is um, if the workers there, and even the owner, if they're open to me, giving them some knowledge on how to care for them. Um, I'll do that. But if they're not, I'm not going to try to force it. Again, if people aren't willing to soak in knowledge, I'm not going to be willing to waste my time and, you know, try to speak with you about it. Um, but back to the bloods, when you're keeping short tails, make sure it is that, make sure you know exactly what it is that you're keeping. Um, she did tell me that she was going to go ahead and keep the Sumatran short tail. Um, and she actually is looking at another Sumatra now. Now that she's um, aware of what he is, I ran over a few of the morphs that come in the Sumatra short tails, and she seems to like them. Her, one of her favorites was uh, the, the chrome head. So um, I think she's maybe a little bit happy about making the purchase. She's just disappointed that someone um, didn't hold up their integrity in making the sale. Had they labeled it as a Sumatran short tail, she might have still bought the snake. It's the fact that they purposely labeled it as a black blood and sold it to her, not knowing what it was. Um, but yes, there is no such thing as a black blood python. It's a Sumatran short tail. There are three different species, blood pythons, Borneos, Sumatrans, from largest to smallest, with these being the Python Brongers Mai, the Borneos being the Python Brighton Steenies, and the, um, the Sumatras being the Python Curtains. So again, just be aware of what it is that you guys are buying. And as always, take care of your reptiles.